Good day everyone, so for this week's video we're doing croissants perfect for any lunch um, just the idea, so this is what's up, this is what's going on stay tuned for the video and we'll explain everything So here we go again, it's time for our YouTube weekly YouTube video um, So first off we're gonna do something special, something different We're gonna use our croissants today um, And what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut it in half, totally right through And then I'm gonna roast it, I'm gonna show you how we're gonna do that And then we're gonna do a filling So here we've got feta cheese We've got, is it feta cheese? Yeah, feta cheese, we've got um, chicken breast, we've got lack of tomatoes and we've got the bacon and butter for the roasting process and then of course we're going to use our Hoyer's Island Bliss also known as lemon and herb this is a perfect sauce for your breakfast for your um, bacon and so forth so I'm going to use this today to actually fry the bacon in the sauce to give it a little bit of flavor as you guys know from our previous videos, normally we have a lot of spice on the table. Today we don't have any spice, we're only going to use what's in here. So our sauce contains all of the spice that you need. If you use the sauce, you don't need anything else. All the flavor, all the quality, all the spices are included in the sauce. Perfect sauces. All right. You forgot something. What did I forget? The green blob there. Oh, and I've got a bit of lettuce here. Yeah, so for the people eating like goats, we're going to use a bit of <laughs> lettuce as well. So yeah, let's start. So I'm just going to cut all of my croissants in half quickly, then we can carry on. You can see we cut all of our croissants in half. Here's my butter. I'm just going to coat it lightly with butter. So light spread. I'm going to spread all of them. As decent as possible, but with a light coat, you don't want too much over too much butter and butter on it. And then I made a mistake. Our chicken breast is smoked chicken breast, so please, um, my wife just informed me I'm an idiot. So smoked chicken breast that we're going to use. There's three of them in total. Very nice. You don't need to cook them. You can use just use them. So I'm just waiting for my my fillet. Um, pan to heat up so I can roast our croissants quickly okay so all our croissants are nicely buttered just a small layer of butter so we can just gonna roast it quickly just a quick one to give it a nice smoky flavor so you leave it like that for about 50 to 60 seconds I'll show you what it looks like when it's done Let's check it, it's been there like for about 40-50 seconds, perfect, roasted, it's exactly what you want, nothing more than that. So this is what you want, so we're gonna, I'm quickly going to roast all of the other croissants and then we're going to start with the filling. So you can see it's not hard, it's still very soft and it's perfect. So you just do that to give it a little bit of flavor, just did it with a bit of margarine, perfect, nothing more than that. Okay, so all our croutons are roasted perfectly. Croissants, croissants, not croutons, croutons, something different. <laughs> our croissants perfectly roasted. That's exactly what I wanted. So it is a bit a delicate type of thing um, because it is the dough they use on this is the same they use in flesh pie steakies. I don't know what's meat pies. So it's a bit uh, brittle. Brittle. So it's a bit delicate. So if you gonna leave it too long in your pan it's gonna get stuck it's not gonna work um, and again if you use too much butter it's gonna get all soggy uh, so a little bit of butter right temperature on your plate uh, pan sorry uh, and then long. about most of them was between 30 to 40 seconds and you can see it's done um, just tap it on the top and you'll see there's no anymore then you know it's finished it's done all right, so I'm quickly gonna start up my pan for the bacon. We will view just now. So then we're gonna start with our bacon. Three pieces at a time. 
And uh, remember what I told you about our lemon and herb sauce, Island Bliss. So all that I'm going to do is I'm going to drizzle a bit over our uh, bacon. And if you're going to do your next batch, you're just going to drizzle this much again. It's about 20, maybe 15 milliliters is not a lot. You don't need a lot. You're just going to move this around a bit. You we'll fry your bacon and when you flip it around, the sauce is gonna, I can almost say, ignite in a pan. All the flavor is gonna come out and it's gonna be like a, a butter caramel type of flavor with the lemon juice that's in there. With your black pepper, I don't know if you guys can see it, with your parsley. There's 26 different spices in here. Um, very fragrant. So it's almost ready to flip. I'm gonna flip it about three or four times. I don't want it to be totally dry and crackling but yeah you can see the, the sauce in the pan starting to boil and the flavors are coming out perfect let me fry all the bacon so this is what we want you see the sauce perfectly in there flavors coming out of this is excellent so we're going to do all of them like this we're going to move them aside we're going to focus on the rest So while our bacon is going in the back, we're going to start with our filling. So this is just a piece of lettuce we cut. We don't want it to be two small pieces. And so I'll replace that. And then we're just going to, to look nice, we're going to put a tomato just sticking out the corners there. See like that. And then we're going to start putting our bacon. So we're quickly going to do this with all of the croissants. So I just want the, want you to see what we do. So you put it the, the points of the tomato just stick out a bit. So when it closes, it looks something like that. So you can see it looks nice. And uh, that's what you want. Okay. There you go guys. So you can see what we did with the bacon. It's a normal strip of bacon. I just fold it in half. Perfectly cooked uh, with the Island Bliss. Perfect. So what we're gonna do now, uh, we are almost done. Sorry for that, I grabbed a piece of bacon so my mouth is watery. We're just gonna take this and cover a little bit. Now this is normal mayo in a bottle, it's nothing special. Just put it in here because I can work with it nicely. So there we go. So now what we're gonna do now, we're gonna put up another slice of lettuce and then we're gonna cut up our uh, chicken breast, the smoked chicken breast, we're going to put that on with the feta and then we are done. So just hang on for that. So there's our smoked chicken breast perfectly on there. So I'm going to put up our feta just now. I'm just going to drizzle a bit of sauce again, mayo, just a bit. And then I'm going to start putting our feta. So you don't want to put too much. It's just to give you all the flavors all over so that's about enough and we can sprinkle it with a little bit of black pepper a little bit of black pepper just to give it color and that's it so I'm gonna round up this quickly then I will show you what it looks like when you're done so that's it for tonight just a quick one this is a perfect lunch if you want to do a lunch it's not a supper or an evening big thing this is lunch or breakfast as well so you can see our lovely bacon there done in the island bliss and then we have the smoked um, chicken there chicken breast and then of course the feta we've got the lettuce we've got tomato you can add um, cheddar cheese to it you can play with it this is this just an idea but yeah that's it for tonight have a nice evening